Louisiana Office of Alcohol and Tobacco Control is implementing new rules starting today, causing restrictions on numerous vape products like this one. I'm Darcy Ortiz, your Jeff Davis Parish reporter here in Jennings, where managers at Galaxy Smoke Shop tell me they're concerned about their profit. The ATC has decided, through whatever means, that unless it's an approved by the FDA item, it cannot be sold in Louisiana. Alex Lance is a manager at Galaxy Vape Shop in Jennings. As of Monday, the state of Louisiana is banning all tobacco retail dealers and wholesalers from selling or possessing vapor or alternative nicotine products that are not listed on the vape directory. I had easily $20,000 worth of disposables here yesterday. Lost Mary, Virgin Mary's, not even talking vape juices, you had Coastal Clouds, Cloud Nerds, Fruit Monster, Ice Monster, Candy King, 15 different brands easily. Smoke shop owner Muhammad Ali feels overwhelmed by the new restrictions, citing most of his customers aren't happy either. We have a, a set group of people that come in there for, you know, a certain vape or a certain e-juice or a certain disposable, which we can't sell anymore. So these people are so used to using that one product, they don't want to switch. And that's what they told us today. One Jennings resident who prefers to remain anonymous says it's not just the people who vape in Louisiana that are impacted. The economy is at stake, too. I think our local shops will lose a lot of revenue and possibly a lot more nicotine cigarettes will be sold and started back up. Ali tells KTC he made several sacrifices to open six vaping businesses across the state, but now he's not sure what to do. If I do shut down, who's going to cover these so many years that's left on the lease, right? I mean, I, I don't know. I've never been in a situation like this. Galaxy Smoke Shop owner Muhammad Ali says he plans to attend court on April 25th to fight these restrictions. I'm Darcy Orti, 